only for some people this morning that have a heart after God, that want to serve and live after the Lord with a purified heart this morning. My heart shall cry out for the things of God. My heart beats for the beat and the drum of what God is giving us for me to do. My heart beat is to please my Father. My heart beat is to live for Jesus. My heart beat is to give my all for the kingdom of God. He's calling you forth this morning, those of you that are watching. Your heart should be to live out, sold out, given out, everything for Jesus. It's time, people of God, to rise up with a heart that is pure, to rise up with a heart that is keep giving and beating for Jesus, because our hearts are sinking on the Lord. What seeks to what is a heart? Imagine the pumping going forth. There's a pumping going forth now in your heart. It's time to get our hearts to get but it's time to pump to the heartbeat of God. But it's over to all notice, it's clean and so God wants to regulate some hearts this morning. He wants to begin to show a love of him with the things of God. I'm back to the altar again. I'm back to the heartless of what God is called to again. So things that affect the heart flow are certain things like this. See this, I want you to be able to see some of our hearts have deceit in them. And some of us, so there's some of us that have lust filled hearts. But God wants to bust up and clean out some hearts this morning. It's time for a purified heart. He wants you to get your hearts in order. He wants you to get your hearts back in place with Him. It's time to have a purified heart. It's time to have a cleansed heart before Him. Your heart is beating for the lust of this world. He's told you numerous times before what he's told you to do. He's saying to the church this morning, wake up, church. It's time to get your hearts in order. Wake up, church. It's time to get back to God. Wake up, church. Stop sleeping when you should be praying. Stop sleeping when you should be witnessing. Stop sitting around when you should be doing the works of God. It's time to get up and get moving. God is waiting for some heart-filled Christians that have a heart of But I wish I had a sing the mind church this morning. Hear all things for you. That when your heart is sitting on God, when your heart is truly in love with God, when you really have a heartbeat, that's what I'm telling you. The heartbeat that you have for God, nothing can take that place. Of God's love is brighter than what you can imagine. You serve a God. You don't get up and do anything for God. Why is your heartbeat? All of these things be in your heart. You gotta see you. I come to chisel out the unforgiveness. I come to chisel out the deceit. I come to chisel out the lust in your life. I come to chisel out the envy in your life. Now, people of God, get to a place now when God is He's doing a cleansing now on Facebook. He's doing a cleansing now on YouTube. He's doing a cleansing now on God is on the God is calling for the private place. Get back in your place and persistent. I'm loving God for real. This is no just no talk about it. This is no be about it, do about it generation. When you just go, declare the word of God in action through the love of Christ. And so you three things that affect your heart are this. You, you affect your own heart because it's how you carry forth the way that you do things in your relationship with God that affects your heartbeat for God. So first thing he wants to do is get you in order. The next thing he wants to do is get us completely in a place of having a renewed heart in the kingdom of God and living for him. The second thing is this, others, Many of us are people pleasers, worrying about what someone is saying, worrying about what they're doing, worrying about how their heart is for you. Listen, the only place of where you need to be in today of worry about what someone is saying or doing. Listen, 